All right, people across Memphis and across the country continue to pay respects to Tyree Nichols. That's right, and this morning our Sydney Hawkins is live with the latest dedication. It's a mural in North Memphis, and Sydney, just a beautiful sight to see behind you this morning. Absolutely gorgeous. Good morning, Sydney and Andrew. The artist who painted this mural behind me, David Yancey, says his typical art pieces are positive, they're vibrant, uh, and they relay a message of hope. And that's exactly what you see uh, in North Memphis, as you mentioned, on the corner of Jackson Avenue and Biggs Street. And the mural is painted on a restaurant and music room building of Steve A's Castle House of Rhythm and Blues. The owner, Steve Adams, told me after the death of Tyree Nichols, he wanted to do something to honor Tyree in a positive light. So he saw Yancey's work before he met Yancey and then got connected with him to do the mural. Adam says Yancey was happy to do the piece, but he needed approval from Tyree's family and they were also on board. And as a black male who's also a skater and someone who also enjoys sunsets, Yancey says he felt connected to Tyree throughout the entire three days that he worked on this mural. This photo is based off of a photo that his family agreed on. Uh, a very, I think that it really made him look, you know, useful, um, handsome compared to the photo that's been released of him in the hospital beaten and bruised. So like, yeah, I wanted people to remember him looking good, happy, glowing instead of that uh, negative picture. So this Saturday, you all can come down here again. This is the corner of Jackson Avenue and Bix Street. Uh, the owner, Steve Adams, and then the artist, David Yancey, will be here for an official unveiling of this piece. But if you aren't able to make it this Saturday, I encourage you to just come out when you can because it truly is a sight to see. For now, reporting live in North Memphis, Sydney Hawkins, Action News 5.